Nice to see you. Uh, let me go th through what you said specifically in this quote to the Washington Post, and I want to ask you why. Let's, let's first let's hear what you said. You said, "quote It's probably not something that appeals to him, but I like the fact that his name is Barack Hussein Obama, and that his father was a Muslim, and that his paternal grandmother is a Muslim. There's a billion people on the planet that are Muslims, and I think that experience is a big deal." Now. Senator, you say that at a time when Barack Obama has to go out from time to time in his events and tell people, I'm a Christian. I'm a Christian because he thinks there's a smear campaign going on under the radar about who he is, trying to maybe peel some people away who might get worried about a guy named Barack Hussein Obama. So some would say this is cynical, a new Hillary Clinton supporter doing this to try to stir this up again. Well, it's not. First of all, I, the, there was a longer answer to the question. I'm a little reluctant to go into it because I'm supposed to be talking about Senator Clinton, but uh, I've got a very high regard for Senator Obama. And uh, the question that I was asked was, uh, uh, you know, he ought to be qualified. You ran in your first term in the Senate as well, and I think that he is qualified. And the two things that I like very much about him uh, that uh, I think will add a tremendous amount of value if he becomes a nominee and gets elected is the fact that as, a, as an African-American, he can speak in an authentic way to uh, uh, underperforming black youth who I, I think will follow his example. And secondly, uh, I do, I, I, there is a smear campaign going on and people uh, acting as if he's an Islamic Manchurian candidate. And I feel it's actually a substantial strength. He is a Christian, both he and his family are, are, are Christians, they've chosen Christianity. But that connection to Indonesia and a, and a billion Muslims on this earth I think is a real strength and add an awful lot of value in his foreign policy efforts. So you have to know when you're about to say something like that that some will twist it, especially in this age of the Internet and the blogs. Did you think about that before you talked about it, or is it Bob Kerry saying, this is what I think, I'm going to say it? No, it's, it's something, by the way, I, I've told Barack Obama when I've met with him. It's, it's something that I've spoken about before. So this is not something that just sort of came out of the head birth out there in Iowa. I thought about it a great deal. I've, I've watched the blogs try to uh, say that, the, that you can't trust him because he spent a little bit of time in a secular madrasa. I feel quite the opposite. I think it's a tremendous strength. Uh, uh, whether he's in the United States Senate or whether he's in the White House, I think it's a tremendous asset for him.